Hi, this is Tim. In this video, I'm gonna show you one of our custom control panels. Each panel we build that has some type of custom functionality gets a video like this made. Now they're not shot for angles, they're not shot to really teach anything. It's really just to show the customer that they're getting the functionality that they're looking for. But I thought they'd be good examples to people who are looking to build control panels or have an idea and they're not exactly sure how to develop it. So let's go ahead and hit play on this one. All right, this is the damper panel. I've, I've added some switches just to simulate everything with. I've got a handoff auto switch. Uh, this is the start from the DCS fire, and that represents one of the dampers, and I have this wired into one of the motors. In front of the panel right now, we have power and our fire shut down. Can't quite see it, there we go. Uh, power and the fire shut down is okay means it will run. So if I switch the HOA to hand, you can see now we have 120 here. And the only thing that will interlock that is our fire shutdown. So I'm going to turn the fire shutdown on, which is the second relay. All the others shut off. And you see now we have zero volt there. Uh, then we can go to auto, which of course right now our fire shutdown is still on, so it's not going to work. We'll turn off the fire shutdown, and now we have 120 because right now we have our start permissive. So this is the start from DCS. So I'll turn it off. See, it goes away. Turn it on. Goes on. And the other thing that is interlocked in it is one of those dampers has to be closed. So if I drop one of those dampers out, it'll turn off, back on, and of course during any situation, if we get a shutdown from the fire system, they go out. If you happen to have a custom control panel you're looking to get built, please feel free to contact us. Here are some other custom control panel videos we have that you may find helpful. And YouTube thinks that you'll like these videos. Also, please hit the subscribe button. We put out at least one video a week. And if you find our videos helped you make some money, but you're not actually using our service, then please consider supporting us over on Patreon. Till next time.